more style, more tech, more agility. BMG ZST, it's the more you've been looking for. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. Townsville's national award winning builder, Kia Constructions. Hit News Briefing. Hello, Kate Smithers with your news briefing. The Sydney Opera House, Melbourne's Flinders Street Station and the Eiffel Tower in Paris have all been lit up blue and yellow overnight to show support for Ukraine. It comes after the country's president, Vladimir Zelensky, made a powerful address overnight saying 2023 is their year and victory is inevitable. We have everything for it. Motivation, belief, friends, diplomacy and you. We have united all powers against this invasion. Back home and a massive fire at a Sydney petrol station has destroyed a fuel tanker, cars and LPG cylinders. Around 60 fireys and 16 fire trucks were needed to bring it under control. No one was injured. Rio Tinto has offered condolences to the family of Perth man Troy Johnston, who was killed in Bali on Thursday. Mr Johnston, who worked for the mining company, was on holidays with his wife and son when it's alleged he was attacked with a bar stool. Pill testing will now be allowed in Queensland after a contract controversial move from the state government, which will see a mix of both fixed and mobile testing locations. And Australia's pop princess, Kylie Minogue, took to the stage in Sydney last night to wow crowds for the opening of World Pride. Her sister Danny also joined her for a performance of All the Lovers. <laughs> Tonight, the iconic Mardi Gras parade will take over the Sydney CBD. Beyond Blue is here to help you achieve your best possible mental health. For more information, advice and support, visit beyondblue.org.au today. In the NRL and the Gold Coast Titans have confirmed Paul Turner has been granted an early release. The 22-year-old played seven games for the Titans after joining from the Warriors in 2022. He's off to join the Dragons this season. And in cricket, Redbacks opener Henry Hunt has stood down as South Australia's captain. Jake Lehman will take over for the rest of the season. SA take on Victoria tomorrow in the March One Day Cup. Winner to book a final Mostly sunny in Townsville this afternoon, a max of 32 degrees, while there's possible showers tomorrow, a top of 31. It's the daily news that matters in under 20 minutes. Search the briefing podcast on Listener, download the app now and listen for free. <laughs>